So I just started filming. Well, I was just going to start filming. Flint down my brows and things and just started pouring down rain. I don't know if you guys can see, but hopefully you can hear it. Ah, it smells so good. Back to work. Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kyle if you're new here, and if you are new here, please go down below and subscribe and become a bleeding heart today and become a member of our family here on YouTube. Um, today's tutorial is going to be a recreation of an old transformation video. If you guys would like to see how I transform into this gorgeous creature, then keep on watching. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be a really fun video. I'm really excited for it. Um, it's going to be a recreation video of one of my old tutorials. Um, in fact, my first tutorial, um, my first drag tutorial that I ever posted. Um, it's really old. It is from December 9th, 2011. So it's been nine years since um, I posted this. And yeah, basically what's really funny to me is that I start out this tutorial um, with a full eye makeup <laughs> choices, you know what I'm saying? No. So I'm just gonna start the video here and see where I'm at. Um, I have, there's no, like, audio, there's no voice, um, so it's not a tutorial. I love that I made a drag makeup tutorial, and it doesn't have any, like, it's, a uh, instrumental of Bridge Over Troubled Water is what I picked to go underneath it, which is beautiful, but... It plays several times and there's no instructions. Yeah, so I start out working on the eyes and obviously I think that I meant to turn on the camera earlier, um, but didn't. And then I'm doing foundation on my forehead. So I'm gonna start with this smoky situation I've got going on so far. Um, I already went ahead and glued down my sideburns and my brows. Back in the day, my brow coverage was not great, I will say that. Um, definitely check out the original tutorial. It's only 7 minutes and 11 seconds, but if you kind of like skim and fast forward through it, it's a really cool like time lapse. Um, and it was like one of the... I, this was at the point in makeup... Sorry, I'm being really rambly now. Um, this was at the point in makeup where I was watching a lot of drag queen tutorials and really studying drag makeup and trying different techniques. So this makeup is very the whole kitchen sink. Paintly, paintly paint pot all over my eyelids. And then she's been set. So And we have some powder so that if we get some fall down, we can clean it up. The cool thing about this type of look and this type of drag makeup though is that it is very um, all-encompassing about drag makeup and I feel like it'll give you a really good starting off point or jumping off point um, for a lot of the techniques you'll use in drag, so I will say that. Let's do some glitter. I'm gonna paint on some I'm Not Afraid to Sparkle some iridescent white. Just set glitter on top. So fun.
Luxe Gel Liner in White, Blanc, number seven. Okay, I'm just gonna paint against. easier if you do the white first, then you can kind of follow it. Okay, so that creates this little open area right in the middle there. Okay, so by now I think, let me make sure here, but I think I'm gonna go from here on to brows, so let's see. And don't worry, we're gonna do a lot of, she does a lot of blending in this video. So I'm gonna take this now crazy long ass paintbrush that I bought from like Michaels and paint on my brows, so that's fun. Okay, I'm just gonna add some V26 um, TV paint stick as my brow. And she did like, I'm gonna do a normal brow, I normally like to do it. video I do like a Spock brow which is kind of unusual I feel like I must have just been trying something out it was fun days back then <laughs> Okay, now I'm deepening and bringing together the crease. So that's what I'm gonna do next. I'm gonna take some of this black, some black, to the outer crease here. And what this will do, as you can see, is it just brings that brown that we used together. Also gonna give a nice outward lift, upward and outward lift to the eye. So um, I'm gonna pop on some lashes and I'll be right back and then we will finish up this recreation look. Okay, welcome back. Hey, hi, how you doing? Um, so I put on some lashes and obviously lashes make a huge difference. I don't know why in this tutorial that I didn't put on lashes last time, but that's crazy. Um, it was my first tutorial though, so I'll give myself a break. Um, so now that we have this situation going on, basically I do some foundation down here and stuff like that and some powdering, but um, I have all that done. So I'm going to go in with some blush and I'm gonna do two kinds of blush. Do a cream first. This is Rosie Does It. Just gonna put some high on the apples. Okay, then we'll do a little bit of highlighter and I'm just gonna pop this on with my finger. I'm going to use Current 830 by NYX. And I'm gonna put a little bit of Prep and Prime lip on first. Okay, 
lipstick, and I do Viva Glam Lady Gaga, which I still have. Barely, I still have it. So now I'm just gonna add one thing that I didn't add in the video, which is snob lip glass. I kept everything pretty matte back then. I didn't do any gloss ever. But these days I love a gloss. Okay. So, the only thing that I know that she is going to do in the video, too, is she does this with the glitter. I think I'm going to stick on some glitter, but I'm not going to do it that way. I'm going to do it with my little liquid glitter here. And we'll just put a bit at the top of the cheek here. Just to really amp up that shine there. I'll pat some iridescent white into there. Back in the day, I just used craft glitter. But oh, how far we've come. I do do a mole. Let's see. Okay. My mole's on the. Ooh. Sorry. My mole's on the left side over here. It's very Marilyn. I was always inspired by Marilyn, and I put on like a really like cheap Marilyn wig at the end of this tutorial, so. A lot of people commented, they were like, I love this makeup. The hair is like, but I love this makeup. <laughs> so funny. Okay. I think we're ready for the final wig reveal and I need to get to my watch party for my current video. So let's do it. This is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial with me, um, recreating one of my old drag looks. Um, if you did love this video, please give me a thumbs up down below and leave me a comment for future content you'd like to see. Um, also, if you haven't yet, please subscribe and become a Bleeding Heart today. Um, become a member of our family here on YouTube. And um, yeah, I think that it came out really nice. Of course, years, nine years, change things a lot. Um, changes your face, changes the way you do makeup, um, and your skills can blossom and grow a lot. So I'm really happy with how this makeup came out. Um, if you'd like to see something specific, again, leave me a comment and I will see you guys all on the next video.